everybody, it's Robert Periello with Century 21 All Points here in Connecticut. Um, I'm here with you this week uh, to discuss where the market's heading here in, in the future. I've had a lot of people ask me how have the rising interest rates affected things. They've kind of gone up and settled back down now. Um, is it kind of slow activity? What's been happening the past few months? So just wanted to review a couple December stats for you that I think are important and paint, paint a nice picture. So I wrote down a few numbers. In December 2017, there were 678 sales in Hartford County of Connecticut. Okay. Now, out of those sales, the average sales price was 256,000. Now, if many of you remember back to December 2017, the interest rates were low. Then they were right around four, even a little under four. Right. Now, if we look at last December, December 2018, there were 677 sales almost identical, one sale apart, right? Average sales price, 254,000. So uh, that $2,000 difference in sales price is really a non-issue. It's a very flat market. The interesting thing that, that I think is important for everyone to know is the interest rates are much higher this December 2018 than they were back in 2017. They had almost gotten up to five, and they settled right about 4.75 for most of the month. So despite the rise in interest rates, we saw average sales price stay the same, amount of home selling sales stay the same. So that tells me we're in a very flat market right now, and I wouldn't expect that to change too much in the future. However, I'm going to do a better job of keeping you updated with these stats since there is so much volatility with the interest rates. So. Robert Periello, Century 21. If you want to email me, it's ctholmesbyrobert at gmail.com. Have a great week.